Now, what be the duties of the music publisher? The music publisher, the one, it is oversee, two, it is promote, three, then it is protect the copyrighted works of the artist. So you go oversee, promote, and protect, or what do you call safeguard? The works or the music of the artist where you protect them. That be what the copyright music publisher they do. So the key responsibilities of the music publisher be say you go register your music copyright for you. So if you did Ghana or Yankee, you go register for the copyright office on your behalf. So if it be you know they do and you for go register. Now when you make so you for issue license for your music, then he you know go collect royalties for you, and then you go collect the music where you distribute, make the stream you know, the money, the earnings of your songwriting, he will collect for you. That be the work of the music publisher. That be if you no go feel them. Now how you go feel make money or as a music publisher how you go feel make your artists make money one you for encourage other artists make the use you your artist in music as covers so you go remember that song way that Saka boys do it was pop smoking song right most of the royalty money you know go that Saka boys are there what they actually got was the fame and the popularity right and some stage performances but some of the technical things, you know, go there because they did a cover of the song which did not belong to them. So as a music publisher, you could encourage people to do your re remixes of your song because that be when you go feel collect royalties for your artist. You understand? You go help make your artist in song, they go feature them um, for movies inside or films inside, for TV shows inside. <clears throat> for radio broadcasting and for commercials inside because it be there where Gofi collects royalties for your artist. You get what I talk. Now, the music publisher also they monitor and take action against people where they know allow them to use the song. So, people where they infringe <clears throat> on the rights of the artist. The music publisher it will handle them for, for the artist. So, you know, to effectively collect royalties for the artist, the music publisher for have understanding. Look at his own, bro. For thorough, thorough understanding of the music monetization structure we did. How did they monetize music? If you know the nooks and crannies, that we for know inside out. So, whether it be, what do they call mechanical licenses? or the public performance synchronization or print licenses where it could tap into and sell them to people where they need them, sheet music, whatever. It will collect royalties for the artists. That'd be the work of the music publisher. The music publisher also could manage the international publishing income through direct affiliation or connect where it gets with other music rights organizations for other countries or territories by partnering with sub music publishers for those other countries you know where they did some particular regions because because your sound will travel outside the country so therefore collect money for their too for you so you for also be aware when you sign contract so I believe if you hide that things they the money from overseas they will collect them the record label will collect for you if you don't watch that side of the contract the money from a will come to you